Hey everybody, what is it about people who throw things away? I have a little short here that I want to share with you. I was thinking about getting some some lights uh, that I could use uh, in various situations on the Ford or anything else for that matter. And I was uh, looking at buying some. Most of them are all LEDs now and that uh, that means that how they're trying to phase out halogens probably in the name of uh probably in the name of greta how dare you um but they cost anywhere between uh 100 150 bucks somewhere in there in the middle and uh, you know i really want halogens um because leds are fail too uh, but I I don't know why. I always like the light better than I do from an LED. Though LEDs do show off or do sport off more lumens than, uh, than anything else. So anyway, I mean, I've got some of those as well. You can see right here I have some Craftsman's. And uh, I want to say where I got this stand. It's the same place that I got this light didn't cost me a dang thing. Well, I mean, it cost me some time, but um, anyway, I was looking at these and then I happened to, uh, at work, um, I happened to, uh, there was a dumpster that everyone uses. Um, it's, you know, to be quite honest with you, it's, uh, it, it's a dumpster that, that uh, is used by electrical people at a government um, school, essentially. And it, this was thrown away. And I just want you to look, look at this. This whole thing was thrown away here. Now, why would they throw something like this away? When I fished it out of the dumpster, the only thing here on the, the back plates were missing, which I made out of ABS plastic here. And uh, to put a new cover on, and the, the lines were cut. The one of the feed lines to the halogen bulbs were cut for whatever for whatever reason and then this piece down here was sitting next to it without the lights so obviously this whole stand here was thrown away and everything worked everything worked fine so i took the lights and i cleaned up all the connectors i opened them up i they were kind of corroded because it had been outside for God knows how long. And I wire brushed them and got all the condensation out of it. And then I, the only thing I had to do was go buy new LED light bulbs. Now these bulbs go, uh, for these, they go up to 500 watts. And right now what I've got on these is a... 150 watts, I think it is. It's 150 watt hal halogen bulbs. And then I picked up uh, some 300 waters that I found on sale someplace else. So I have a spare. Um, they're hot, uh, sort of. Be good in the winter. Um, but uh, this telescoping, telescoping stand, I mean, it'll go far up in the air and it can shoot into my engine on my Ford over here. So, I mean, it's gonna be useful. But why in the heck would people throw something like this away? I mean, it was really, <laughs> it was really wasteful, to say the least. Um, so after here and here, I didn't get this one on there too well. I just used ABS plastic, drilled the hole, and found some screws to screw in there. Um, it uh, would pop the breaker, and the reason for that is because the grounds were bad. And I think there was still a little more condensation out, so I took them all, took this one in particular, this light here, this was the one blowing it off, uh, and let it really, really dry out. There was a little bit of condensation in the ceramic connectors for the, uh, the bulbs are like this, and they have two little prongs on the end that they sort of um, slip in on a spring. But, I don't, you know, Perfectly good lights, perfectly good stand there down there with my um, with my craftsmen's, and they just threw them away for what? Uh, it's kind of.
kind of disgusting. But anyway, I salvaged it, and uh, hey, it's my gain. For $8, I got myself a 130 some odd dollar light. All right, all right, all right. Uh, that I can use in my shop. Nice. All right, Anglos, don't throw stuff away, man. Use it, you know? Um, you'll save the environment doing so. How dare you?